Hey guys, it's Stoner here again, and welcome back to another video, and today we're back in Need for Speed 2015 for another car build, and today I wanted to experiment with the Honda Civic Type R, but just because there was new parts added onto this car over the last update, we'll give this car a try. Alright, so there's no body kits available, however, there are just plenty of options going around the car. So first off, let's take a look at the hood, so we have a carbon hood. I'll take that carbon hood and now the front bumpers so before we just had the Honda front bumpers but now we have that yep I'm going with that so now looking through the fenders we have all of these and then we have some bolt-on fenders I think that looks pretty weird so I'm gonna go ahead and put that one on and now with the side skirt um yeah I'll take that now I knew we we're missing something on the front end we also have headlights I'm gonna go ahead and go with the taped lights because I think that looks pretty cool. So we have a few options on the back including some tail lights now. Um, I'll go with the LED lights. So this is kind of a shocker. We have diffusers. So we have this one, that one, and that one. But I'm going to go with the craziest one which is that one. Because that looks sick. Yes, I'm going to go with that. I don't care what you say. I'm putting that on. And we also have a spoiler. So we have the stock wing. What, what the fuck is that? So we have this wing, and we also have a carbon wing. That's a no-brainer. We're gonna go with this one. Mate, if you go over 80 miles per hour, that wing is just gonna fly off. Well, time to also stance it, so we're gonna lower it all the way down as always. Completely negative camper on both the rear and the front. And then we'll adjust the wheel offset. There we go, I think that looks nice on the back, and on the front, we'll go about right there. I think that looks okay. What the fuck have I done? So I don't even know how we forgot this part. But it's time for the rims. So yeah, um, I think we definitely settled with some rims. And then I'm gonna go ahead and put on some Speed Hunter stretch tires because gotta have some stretch tires. And you know what? I haven't gone for this yet. We'll go with some Stop Tech calipers. And then I'm gonna go with some drilled brake discs. Yeah, I can definitely tell there's already some hate on this video. And yeah, I'm all done with the paint on this and come on. I had to go with the JDM sticker, I'm, I'm sorry. But yeah, let's go ahead and hop into some races. Alright guys, so now we're doing the first event of today, uh, which we're just gonna start off with a little bit of a drift contest, and hopefully, um, wh why the fuck did I pick front wheel drive? And hopefully I can win with my front wheel drive monster. So yeah, just in case you may want a piece of uh, the front wheel drive monster, I'll put the two on the screen right now. Um, if you want to copy it down for yourselves, um, and I think it's it's okay. Obviously, you're not supposed to drift front wheel drive, but you know, fuck it, it's Need for Speed. But yeah, there's 900 horsepower in this car. Doesn't feel like it, but once you get on the straight, just look at the speed. With nitrous, the thing just pulls. Now let's go around this corner. Holy shit, that was a little much. All right, take two. Bunch of speed around this corner. Mm, that's definitely not working. All right, so we're winding down on the event right now and honestly this thing did a whole lot better than what I was expecting it to do but there we go first place in the uh, the one and only front wheel drive monster so yeah I think we succeeded in that event so let's move on to the next one and now we're in the last event of today and we're in a little bit of a different environment this time we are in the El Rey mountains because previously we we're in the city and now I wanted to see how this thing does downhill. Now like I said, this car is not bad at all. Uh, for a front wheel drive car, this car is definitely a lot better than what you would expect it to be. Because I mean, look at that, I already have 130k. Alright, you know what, I'm coming for your ass, at okay. That, that was pretty easy. So right now, I just want to hold first place and just see how many points I can actually score. I don't know what the record set on this track is, but I think I'm doing really, really well. And now around the final corner, there we go. Come on, keep the drifts. And across the line with a 17,000 point final drift. That was pretty good. So that is going to conclude today's video. So if you guys did enjoy this video, be sure to leave a like. And I may have another video coming out later on today or tomorrow. I'm not sure at this point uh, with Speedway. So be sure to look out for that. And I will see you guys next time. Goodbye.